Welcome back to It's Time for Yarn. Today, we're unboxing the Santa Sack from Lion Brand. Let's get started, guys. This is my first time ordering from a uh, big brand, ordering a mystery box, period. So, um, I loved the yarn box that my subscriber, Alicia, sent to me. Um, that was my very first time ever receiving any kind of mystery type box. But this is one that I actually ordered to um, do kind of like a Christmas in July thing, kind of fun. Um, I have eyed other mystery boxes and longed for them deeply, but never did buy it, never did buy them. But this time, <laughs> I couldn't resist. So, so cool. Look at that. All right, it's a Santa pack. Oh my gosh, this is so cool. This will look neat under my Christmas tree. I, I don't like red, but like Christmas is about the only time I can tolerate red. Oh my gosh, there's like a lot more yarn in there than I thought would be in there. <laughs> like looking at this box, it's, it's a decent sized box, but I'm like, oh, there, there might not be that much yarn, but this, it like expanded or something. All right, let's see. Cute secret stash by Santa. Oh, secret stash of yarn by Santa. Lion brand yarn. Secret stash. I mean, we all have those ones that we keep in the back of our car so that uh, nobody knows that we bought more yarn when we don't need any more yarn. But hey, here we go. Let's see. I see some cotton right away. Okay. I have, what is this? Look. Cotton blend. Comfy cotton blend. All right, from Lion Brand. Look at this color. I like this color, a good neutral color. Like it. Okay, this is called Mochaccino. <laughs> Mochaccino, sounds delicious. <laughs> I like it, what is it? It is a light three weight, which is a little lighter than what I'm used to making or working with. I love chunky yarns, those are my favorites. But, like, this would be nice for trying to make a wearable like I'm tr like dabbling into those so uh, we'll see how that goes it calls for a size J hook cool it feels good feels nice all right I got three of those let's see what else is in here some new boo awesome I had oh my gosh and I love this color this is totally my color it's like lion brand knows me as a person or something let's see I mean, they don't, because this is hashtag not sponsored yet, <laughs> but uh, we'll see. Uh, this is called Duck Egg. Oh my gosh, I love that. I love birds. Um, my dad raised birds when I was growing up, and so I, I just, I love them. We had like peacocks and guineas and turkeys and geese, chickens, uh, quail, <laughs> so I love birds. Oh, this is called Duck Egg. It's a beautiful like greenish color, like a minty seafoam kind of green. I love that. 100% Lysol. Eco-friendly production of Lysol. Fabric made from plants leads to the fiber leads the fiber industry in terms of energy and water conservation. Wow. Cool. I like it. That feels really good. It's a medium four. Okay. Still kind of thin feeling for a medium four, but hey. Sustainable. Sustain sustainable stitching <laughs> I got three of those I don't know what to make with this because I usually make bigger things but hmm, interesting leave a comment down below if you know what I can make with these <laughs> and let's see oh I have one more package pack of three. Oh, some ice cream I made a baby blanket with a blue one all right, this is called licorice. <laughs> licorice. I like that. That's cute. I made actually these blankets back here. That one I made a short uh, that like, looked like cotton candy. It was just it's fun and silly. But uh, this is called licorice. Ooh, I like those colors. Nice and neutral colors. Be a good baby blanket for like a a woman who's waiting to give birth before she finds out what it is. She doesn't know the gender yet. That's pretty. All right. Love it. What is the weight of this? Let me see. See, this is a medium four. See, now look. Somebody somebody in the comments is going to be able to help me with this. But this says it's a medium four. All right. It says, yeah, medium four. And this says it's a medium four. But if you look at them and compare those, 
they, I don't know, to me, they don't look like they're the same weight. I don't, I don't know. Maybe it's just me. Maybe I don't have enough experience to, like, be able to tell the difference or, like, yeah, like, this, this ice cream yarn seems to be a lot fluffier, a lot thicker than the Nubu yarn. Hmm. Interesting. All right, I got three of those. Awesome. This one ball was $11.99, original price. I paid $26. $20 for the bag, $6 for shipping. Uh, so, let me see, that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. that's nine. So approximately three and a half dollars for each of these balls. Hmm, not a bad deal. Awesome. All right, guys, thanks for watching. I'm excited to make some things with these new yarns. And uh, comment down below if you know some things that I can make you'd like to see on the channel. Enjoy the rest of your day. And no matter what time it is, always remember, it's yarn o'clock somewhere. So it's always time for yarn.